and uh, uh, and what is going on YouTube? Just another game channel, bring you just another video. So guys, we can hold this episode 5.1 because apparently I was running too much software, my computer was too slow, so it shut down and uh, it just cut off recording on episode five. So we finished the thief's a thief. Thief is my thief. Um, adventure. Now we're going to do the next adventure because it's worth an upgrade point, which is particularly nice. And uh, we'll track that right now, uh, which is there. Oh, we're, we are tracking it. Okay. Bad neighbours. All right. Let's go. I just tried to do a public event on me on the tank one. I managed to turn it into a heroic, but there's no chance at my level. No chance I could actually uh, take him out. But I've taken out, even at my highest character level, which is 286, I have taken out the uh, the heroic tanks once on my own. I've also done the blight ones on Earth on my own once. Uh, that was when I had the merciless fusion rifle equipped. And that, uh, that just, I think, in most cases, that one-shotted that thing. Definitely two-shotted it. Or it sometimes it one-shotted it, which is awesome. Now, some people playing it, let's go do this. This time they've turned into a heroic. Yeah, nice. Look at those caches. They never learn. Then teach them a new lesson. Show me the power. Give me a goddamn bazooka. Here we are. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I did that. That's, that's what I like about Destiny 2. There is no teamwork at all. Nobody actually helps. Like, no one will revive you. Everyone's too busy running for chess. It is amazing that, literally, it's, Destiny 2 is an odd game because, same as Destiny 1 in PvP, no one communicated. In fact, I had someone on my friends list who got so arsy because I was calling out people's names, it deleted me afterwards, so apparently couldn't concentrate. I'm like, dude, if you can't do what needs to be done, the bare minimum, which is support your teammates and call out enemies on PvP, you shouldn't be playing PvP. My crew says we've got two problems. Wizards on a tower roof doing who knows what, and the Fallen they've spooked. So who do we fight? Fallen first. They're using fuel cells to build an explosive Jeez. countermeasure to the measure. hive. Sloppy stuff. Make It'll blow us all sky high. Oh, there must be a servitor around here somewhere. Oh, boom, sunshine. Okay, boom. Oh, ow. Maybe I should have this as healing. This. I do like the extra damage though, I've got to say. He's a tough captain, isn't he? Oh, I'm dead. I need to activate Devour. Come on, where is my Devour? Oh shit. We've got their fuel oh, he just runs away all the time, so I'm sorry about these today. four You have to chase them all over the place. They oh, they jump up and then they're, just, they're gone, they vanish. Good. Right. Oh, Sending use the water. Right. To the hive. Right. Gordon's hive. If we tweak this and rejigger that, that should work. What should work? We'll call it a hive disruptor. There we Let's go. go. Some shine. Some I think he will level. No, the, the big knight, the big yellow knight, he's tough. He's like level 200. Oh, I cannot kill him. Even Nova Bomb barely took, barely took any health off him. So hopefully this won't quit this time. It won't slow down. So. It's fine though, because we're not actually doing a campaign mission until... Until we get started. But it's always worth jumping in on Publix. I don't think I can get, you can get exotics till you reach level 20, because... You know, I've got my, I've got my medallion active. I mean, it's not, don't really, it's not really supposed to work in... In... Uh, campaign, but, you know, the fact that campaigns mix... Let's see... I'm not upgrading at the moment, because... Oh, yeah, because I'm trying to um, 
Yeah. yeah, I want to do these armor sets, you see, so that's why I've not infused them into my helmet to nudge them up a little bit higher. Once I've done, once I've finished this episode, which will be, um, this will be, what will this be? It'll be this adventure for the upgrade point, which I've got, by the way. Uh, you know, I've actually not upgraded any into this. Shall we have a look? Well, okay, I've upgraded a couple. Hmm. Yeah, I know that one. Shall I look at that? Apparently, uh... Nice. Ah, huh, there's a chest. So you can float and glide and throw grenades and all sorts of shit. Pretty cool. What is this class called anyway? Dawnblade, of course it is. I'm an idiot. Airborne kills, recharge your grenade and melee energy. Casting Daybreak instantly fills your ability. It's daybreak. Oh, that's Daybreak. Instantly refills your grenades, that is awesome. That is really good, that. It's just, you got to remember to use the damn thing, don't you? Oh, shit, big dude in there. Fuck, he's in there. I can't kill that. Oh, I'm gonna have a quick sneak peek, but there's no way I can kill that. Did you see it? It's one of the big boys. Oh my god, wow! Yeah, light level 200. I'm like 140, I don't know, something like that. Probably not even that. Anyway, let's carry on with the main quest, boys and girls. That is a nice ability. So, so the bottom one has strike enemy, they explode, daybreak, six enemies, that's really good. Killing enemy extends, that's really good. And that's slamming to ground and does explosive damage. And also hell heals you, that's really good. Middle air dodge roll, yeah, okay. versus the witch's darkness. The light is stronger. Swift strike, I don't know what that means. Oh shit. Oh my god, I can't hit shit like that. Don't hover away an SMG guys. Okay. I know it doesn't give him back, but it gives a big chunk of him back. Wait, does it? I thought it said instantly. Let's have a look. Yeah, okay, yeah, alright. No, it recharges them, but it recharges, yeah. Not instantly, but it's like quite quick. Shit, I thought I was, oh man, I was trying to test my daybreak thing, I thought I had it. I do have it, oh. What happened there? I'll heal while I kill. Myself a little overshield. 
tight and seems like a creepy place to live. This massive, these big things are in the ocean. Yeah. Is that not creeping anyone out? I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Ooh. Nice. Way better assault rifle. Perseverance, this thing's... Well, this called, this one's called some. The Wicked, these guys, fantastic. The uh, fast rate of fire, no recoil, essentially. Legendary versions are better, obviously. Oh, shit. You know, like how you can float and shoot. That is nice. That is a nice ability. Give me that green loot, yo. Ooh, excuse me, Michael. 155. It's the sword I want. Fucking powerful as hell, swords. Jesus. Not many people bother because you want they want that distance, but I swear to God, guys, the sword is fucking phenomenal. Uses three on an R2 ammo instead of five from Destiny 1. And does a three strike, and we've all got slight different abilities. I can't wait to see some exotic swords. Oh shit. Get on the What is Swift Strike? I don't know what that is. What is Swift Strike? I don't understand. My healing is more powerful than you! <laughs> what is that swift strike? Swift strike, swift strike. It's. What is it? Oh, okay. Oh, right, you burn him. And temporarily increase your movement speed and reload speed. Nice, okay. Last for 12 seconds, that's cool. Jesus, incredible. Let's go back there. Let's try the switch, switch strike. Oh, yeah, that's way faster. Nice. Oh, beautiful. That's 12 seconds. Not bad. Imagine we have mobility on, Jesus. Up. You're looking for the top of a tower, the central platform. <laughs> Eliminate the wizards, destroy their project, and stabilize this rig. This jump is phenomenal, look at this. Do nothing. I can feel the shaking from here. What did you do? Tell you later. Kaboom. Kaboom. Someone's joining, guys, so. I apologize for the double conversation in a minute. So good. Die, bitches, die. I 
Why not, eh? Boom. Two kills, that sucks. That grenade will just eat through all of them. Oh. And when you get the sunbreak, yes. Oh, shit. Oh, the parry you, so I can do that. That's it. Oh, I've got that reload speed. Ooh. He dead, bro. That should be an upgrade point again. Woohoo! Okay, not quite, not quite. Yeah, uh, should have known about it. Forgot about the big bad witch. That's all you want. My healing is more powerful. Okay, maybe not that powerful. I've got a fusion rifle. Oh! Oh, get on, son. Got him, Snow. How bad's the damage? Minimal. Nothing your crews can't mm, fix in a day, day or two. Really, it looks as good as new. More importantly, the resonator's gone. <sighs> I'll take your word for it. Yes. Found your clients, P. Yeah. Woo. Okay, profit show. 54, two men. Profit show. Wait, hang on. One sec. 176. 176. Okay. That's fine. Uh, 153, 173. Okay, that's fine. Extra helmets I need. So that should be. Still got two slots. Nice. So. Midair to dodge. Okay. Oh, nice. You get a 10 second cooldown, but imagine that in PvP. That's annoying. Boom, and then... <clears throat> yeah, and then, alright, let's, let's go do the last one of this. Uh, active while in mid-air, you quickly descend. Oh, that's the other one. Damn it, these both... I thought this class would be way better, because the, the daybreak tracks enemies and it extends it. Enemies explode, but this one we reload, setting them on fire. Um, you can throw grenades and while aiming, and it, re it boosts you. I mean, I honestly don't know. I honestly don't know. I mean that. It's nice. It's a nice ability. I didn't mean to hold on too soon, there. My bad. Uh, okay, so we're going to track this. We're down here in the tidal anchors. So we're going to teleport back here. And we will do this next mission. And then we'll call that episode 5.1. I do apologise about that screw up guys. Not intentional. For some reason my amazingly powerful computer. Tends to think sometimes it's not that powerful or amazing. But it has only 8 gig of RAM. Which I'm gutted about. I didn't know when I bought it that it can't be upgraded. None of the Macs can these days. Uh, so when I bought it I ordered an extra 32 gig of RAM. Yeah. No point. All Saving all my tokens for when I'm high level. Uh, also, what else? Um, yeah, the new Power Mac, that one coming out with 18 cores. Man, I really want to buy it. I'm so tempted. 18, 18 CPU cores, and that's an iMac. Freaking iMac. Okay. 10 minutes on that. Hour left on that. Okay, that's fine. So, does it do? I guess it only does uh, explosive damage one when you've got your ability active. Okay. While well, we're here, let's not want that. Some public events to get my, my 
arc ability. Which I don't think I've seen any of it on this. I've not seen any of the arc stuff. I've seen a tiny bit on Destiny 2. Didn't really pay much attention. Now we're running faster and fast. Up and down the stairs we go. Where we're gonna stop, nobody knows. Well, apart from the big juice red icon, I think we're, ah, we're going inside where all the hive are. Yay. Creepy. Creepy indoorsness. Ah, oh, I'm just about to drop, drop that from before. Give me that, give me that. It's a red war. Now, this is not a cutscene. This is just going to teleport us in exactly where we need to go. Which is absolutely fine. Holiday has detected an unusual amount of electricity being redirected into the arcology. Yep. Juice like that can only mean one thing. A network of CPUs. Powerful ones. Maybe powerful enough to decrypt Indeed. that cabal signal we intercepted. Unfortunately, we don't know where the network might be located. So, you're gonna have to snoop around, not draw too much attention. Guardian. Securing this asset could turn the tide of this war with the Red Legion. Without it, I don't know what comes next. So yeah, that slam to the ground does. You don't have to have Daybreak active white to heal. Uh, but if you've got it active and you slam, it does a big explosion. Ooh. Hello, sunshine. It's got a fast charge rate on it. Oh, I like that. Two sets of classes are pretty interesting. They've got they've both. Got, they've actually, I would really, I would, I'm a bit gutted that they've stripped away. But yeah, like a lot of people in Destiny One just Looks use like the, the same trying to break classes. Tiles. So this time they force you to use one or the other, which is I thought at first was going to be really frustrating. But but they've done a really good co sets of combinations. Sounds like the Arcology's operating system is back online. I knew it. Keep an eye out for an OS access terminal. You can use it to pinpoint the CPU network. You're trying to dodge and roll like a hunter. So you should play with a hunter. You know what I'm saying, wee laddie? Not sir, tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen, make sure you've got enough legendary marks. Oh, I've only got 41. Oh, that sucks. I'm going to have to delete some legendary stuff out of my vault. Hopefully if I can grind enough today, I'll start getting legendary stuff from, from this character as well, which I can delete. Over there. One of the access terminals we're looking Indeed. for. Scan away, sunshine. Scan away. The CPU network is deep in the maintenance levels. Amanda, is this what we're looking for? Bingo! That's the place. Okay, I've cut the location. Let's find a way down. Come on, you hide monsters. Oh shit! You don't come on so soon.
see if it works. Yes, it does. Nice. Turn red. I don't. Is that the priority tie? Is that my helmet doing that? Is it because it's low health? I don't get it. This helmet. I don't understand how it works. Might as well get rid of that. I know. No, no, no. Oh, okay, good. I want to keep the sword because it's so cool, but I can't because you know, oh, you know, I can't use it. But it's so cool looking. I like the square blades and shit. Shit. There we go. Looks like the hive dug a shortcut for us. Let's head down that hole in the ground. We're definitely in hive territory now. Keep radio chatter to a minimum. We don't want to blow Hold that for me a sec, everybody. Thank you, sir. Ooh. Like that explosion. Oh, I forgot I've got a big bunch of thralls then. On a healing sunshine. On healing. Oh, if I had that, if I had my melee bag, oh, they would have all exploded. Damn. One, one at one. Oops. One kill one that have exploded. Oh, that would have been sweet. Choose. See, the other one lets you glide and shoot, and that the other class lets you glide and shoot, and then you get your shit back. Oh, really good. This helps track target. Oh, look at that, beautiful. Actually, I think a big yellow dude's gonna come out in a minute after I've killed these guys. Which is gonna suck for me. I honestly don't know which class to use. They're both really good. Dodging midair or jump down and what, slam and get your health back. Or, you know, float for ages and aim and get your grenades and melee back while you kill, while you floated. Oh, there's so much. So so few choices give you so many choices. <laughs> I knew they were going to be a big dude, but I'm an idiot. But... Oh, he's a goner. That grenade should just pass out to him. There he goes. Go booey. Do we have the full achievement set now? Yeah, we do. And we can infuse that 173 at least. For the time being. So we've got a Tamon, Tomen, Tomen, Cosmic Wind. Don't need the Raven Shard. Cosmic Wind's pretty cool. Looking Prophets, Prophet Snow, okay. Do we have we have got Prophet Snow? Prophet Snow Arms. Prophet Snow. So we've got a Prophet Snow attunement basically. They're the, the next two Uh, the next two armor sets we'll be doing, guys, for the Warlock. We're getting closer and closer to that that awesome loot. Is it up we go? I don't know. Was it down? Should oh there we are. Oh no, it's down straight down. No, well, not straight down, but Oof.
Beautiful design setting. All this technology, golden age technology. CPU banks, thousands of times more powerful than what we've got now. Oh. I'm just going to see if there are any more there, but it's happening to explode. Mind. You do actually drop down here, yeah. I honestly don't know what the problem is. This wall of glide is fantastic. You know how much distance you get on the dawn breaker? You get a lot of distance when you glide, especially with the one where you can aim as well. Holy shit. That is a lot of glide, I'm telling you. I don't know why people have such issues with it, really. I guess just people aren't used to warlock, I suppose. I found it easier to reach places with Warlock than when. I mean, the Hunter's fairly straightforward. No, I've never had any problems control. Oh shit. Was I meant to go up there? No. Sometimes you just don't. Oh, it's Alien 1, innit? <laughs> Alien. On ship. Through air vents. Yes, shit. I keep forgetting you don't have to float to this, you can just drop below straight there. No way the hive didn't hear that alarm. We got the CPU, but we stirred up the entire hive colony. Uh -huh. It's a long walk to the surface. Move it, God. They're not going to make it out of there, Commander. God, can you make it to the center of the arcology? We should be able to send someone to pick you up from there. Holiday. Yeah. Yeah, I'm on it. The tanks, but they've got no weapons. Just smash through shit. I love it. Crunch, 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 crunch. Oh, that's not giving me a glimmer. Or XP. Really? I'm strapping in and about to take off. Oh, it's like. Commander. It's like uh, bugs on the windscreen. Fly fast. I see. Yes, sir. Come on, sunshine. Crunch. The problem is with this game, there's no epic sea cutscenes or no epic levels that like really blow you away. You know, like some games, just like you do a level and you watch a cutscene to it, like pretty much all the Witcher game, and you're just blown away by it. You go, oh my god, you know, you get you get you get fuse pools and you, you start you know it rocks your emotions every other way. There's nothing like that in Destiny. It's a bit, it's a bit man, you know. That's what it feels like. Not, not that it's, you know, not that I'm disappointed. All the designs are great, but they're not. There's, no, there's nothing that sticks out. Driving, driving. Got eyes on you, pal. Meet you at the end of the road. Hey, Titan. Oh, is it? Okay. So there is land on Titan. Okay. Oh, it's indoors. Yeah, of course. Makes sense. This is artificial. And there we go. That is part 5.1. <laughs> or part 6, however you want to look at it. Come see. Come see, guys. It's a come see. It takes a lot to destroy some. The 
the destabilizing its gravity, adding extra mass, super critical mass, I don't know. They call it the Almighty. The crown jewel of the Red Legion and life's work of their leader, Dominus Gaul. Gaul has subjugated hundreds of worlds. Those that resisted no longer exist. You see, the Almighty annihilates stars. This happens every day in our universe, in galaxies, even with planets with civilizations around them. Do you know, I'll be honest, I think if, our, we, if we knew our sun was going to go supernova in the next couple of centuries, I Nothing, think we'd, we'd colonize no not planets in this system, I think we'd create FTL. We'd have we'd what he wants all the money into it. It's the Traveler. And it's light. As for the Almighty, it's now pointed at our sun. In short, sir, the war's over. I'm and we've just lost. getting started. It is the real deal, y'all. <laughs> is it real deal, y'all? We built our home under the protection of the Traveler. When our enemies attacked, we built a wall that stood for centuries. But now walls mean nothing. This enemy has taken our home, taken our light, and now they threaten our very existence. We're going all in on this almighty. How long before the fleet's combat ready? Zavala, wait. If we wait, we die. But if we attack together, we can take back our home, our light, our hope. Or we die trying. Now, I need my fire team. I need Ikora and Kind. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Let's go get some and meet them guardians. Just on a sad note, guys, the earthquake, eh? Hundred Ma in Mexico City where it just, there's hundreds of lives lost. That 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 location is a hundred miles away from where the epicenter of the earthquake began. So a hundred mile radius in every direction. Yes, Warlock? something to say okay I'm just gonna have a quick little look so what she's got all ears 186 186 cosmic wind cosmic wind I'll take that I'll take that that's fine Dismissed. Um, can do these as armor videos soon uh, okay ladies and gentlemen thank you episode however you want to look at it is 5.1 or part 6 of the campaign thank you so much and i will see you on the next one so cheers